Hi everyone and welcome to another episode. Today I want to show you how to build a tower house. Obviously, here we have a layout of this building and every blocks which we need. Okay, the first step is very simple because we are building a foundation. We are using stone and stone and cobblestone. But first of the all, we are adding droppers in this place and in this place. Now, in the middle, we are building randomly, randomly stone and cobblestone. Don't care how I built it, just build and add blocks. Now we are adding here a cobblestone and cob and stone. On the other side we are doing everything in the same way or really similar. Ok, the first step is done. Ok, the next step is really simple because we are building walls. Fa four, <laughs> 4 blocks high. 1, 2, 3, 4. And we are building the first wall in this place. And obviously we are using stone and stone bricks. And the second one we are building in this place. This is a really simple task, just fill and remember to don't care about pattern, just add these blocks randomly. Ok, when we made this, it's time to build entrances. So, we are adding here a stone brick stair, here another one, another one and another one. Now we are adding decoration, that's it spruce trapdoors here 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 and here as you can I <laughs> probably as you know on the other side we are doing everything in the same way okay that's cool but before we go to the next step first we should replace these blocks for stone or cobblestone the choice is your now we are building suspended selling so we are adding oak locks here here and the last one here. Ok. Between the oak logs we are adding spruce slabs. And now it looks quite cool. Ok, the last decoration is adding stone button in the first oak log and the last oak log. Ok, our entrance is done. Now we should focus on the next step. That is another walls. So we are building another level of the walls with the same materials as before. Ok, in this place we are adding <laughs> any blocks, so you can add dirt or other blocks, I'm using dirt because it's the cheap. Now we are adding reinforcements, so we are adding 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3. And on the top we are adding stairs. Obviously, on the other side, we are doing everything in the same way. This is a really simple task. Ok. Ok, the next step is adding another level of the walls. As always, we are using the same blocks. This is so simple. And now, in this place, we are building a pattern floor. I, I recommend using oak lock, but of course, you can use other blocks. So, if you want using, I don't know, stone bricks, always you can. But, in my opinion, wood looks quite cozy. Ok, when we made a pattern floor, now we are adding another walls, but we are not adding in these three blocks, because here I want to create an entrance, another entrance, and will be really similar to this. So, we are destroying these three blocks and we are extending the floor. Ok, that's nice. We are adding one, two uh, blocks, of course. And here one, two. Now we are adding stone brick stairs, another stone brick stairs, spruce trapdoors, and our entrance is done. Now we are adding windows. Here we, are, here we are adding the first, the second, and it looks cool. If you want, you can add a spruce fence gate and trapdoors on the top. In my opinion, this is really similar decoration, but it looks quite cool to the, to the medieval buildings. Of course, on the other side, we are doing everything in the, in the same way. And now. Okay, but of course, I have to add a decoration. Anyway, now we are adding another three blocks to the high. One, two, three. And the next step is filling the rest of the walls to this level, just simple, this is really simple, just built it. Ok, when we made the walls, it's time to build the top and the floor, so we are building another 
pattern floral. And again, I'm using spruce. Uh, I'm sorry, <laughs> oak log. I think oak log looks pretty cool, pretty cool. But remember, in this place we are adding trapdoor and ladders. Okay, now we have built the rest of the the rest of the floor. This is a really simple and really fast task. And remember, if you want other, if you want to use other blocks, always you can. This is only tutorial. I don't say you have built like this. You can always do something other. Okay. When we made this, now we should add a suspended ceiling. So again, we are adding oak log here and here and in this place. And between oak logs, oak, oak logs, we are adding spruce slab. That's nice. Okay, the next step is building a battlement. So we are adding in this place cobblestone wall, here another one and another one. Now we are adding two polished on the side, here three polished on the side and again two polished on the sides. Between the polished on the sides we are adding polished on the, si on the side stairs and on the top we are adding polished on the side slabs. In this place we are adding only two polished on the side and here again two polished under uh, polished under sides. Okay, probably as you know, in in this place, in this place, and in this place, we are doing everything in the same way. Okay, almost every basic things is done. Now we should take care about the entrance to this room. So here we are adding spruce stairs. Now we are adding temporary auxiliary blocks, and now we are adding spruce trapdoors. Now we have destroyed this. Again, we are adding stairs, stairs, and stairs built in this way. Okay, under the stairs we are building spruce trapdoors and close them. This place, the, in this place we are adding lad ladders, and here we are adding two trapdoors, another auxiliary temporary blocks. Spruce trapdoors, spruce trapdoors, and another, and another, yes, and another spruce trapdoors. Okay, the entrance is done. If you want, you can add a lantern. So here, adding a wall. Under, we are adding fence, lanterns, and if you want, you can add spruce trapdoors. In my opinion, it looks cool. So on the other side, I'm doing everything in the same way. And the last optional step is adding leaves, but this is a necessary, not necessary, so as you wish, you can add. Okay, when we made the basic things, it's time to move on to the interior. Okay, the interior is really simple because the space here is really small. So, we're adding a bed, I prefer add a blue bed because blue is my favorite color. On the bed we're adding spruce slabs and two spruce trapdoors and if you want you can add a banner in my opinion this is a fantastic decoration here we are adding a barrel and here we are adding another two barrels here we are building shelves so the one one spruce slabs and three spruce trapdoors here we are adding barrels barrels and barrels here we are adding flower pot and here another one flower pot in this space we are building the area, the, the work area. So we are building three blocks of the spruce, uh, I'm sorry, bookshelves. On the top we are bu building spruce slabs, one lectern, one book, and this is time to build a chair. I prefer building chair in this way that's I building a spruce slabs. <coughs> then we are adding sp two spruce tra spruce trapdoors, one spruce trapdoors and another one spruce trapdoors. If you want, you can add another ba another banner. In my opinion, it looks quite cool. Okay, the next step is creating here a small tree, so we are adding a fern and three blocks of the dark oak leaves. Here we are adding the we are building a wardrobe, so we are adding the one doors and the second doors. In the mid in the in the side, we are adding armor stands. Here I also prefer adding uh, armor stands. We are close, I prefer always close one, one open and on the top we are adding two spruce slabs. 
This area is fantastic to build to build a small kitchen. So we are destroying two this this two blo two <laughs> we are destroying these two blocks, adding campfire, one furnace and one smoker. On the top we are adding two spruce slabs, one lantern, and that's nice. Okay, next to the lanterns we are adding fans as a decorative blocks. Here you can create a carpet, carpets. I add a simple one color and this place next to the bed I in my opinion fit perfectly as a place for a chest. Ok, as a decoration you can add some leaves but this is optional step so if you don't like leaves you can't do this. Ok, let's move on to the top. Ok, the last steps, probably the last, almost the last. We are adding here spruce trapdoors and if you want you can add a banner here. Of course, you can add a pattern to this banner to mark who is the owner of this tower. Okay, this is the, the whole tutorial. This is a really simple and I think quite cool tower for, for the first base. Okay, this is everything. Thanks for watching. Let me know what do you think about tutorial like this and take care everybody. Also, a big thanks for the every patrons and memberships on my channel. Take care everybody and stay safe.